Alright guys, it's Bog27 here, playing some more Minecraft. So yesterday I was, um, I was just playing some solo, you know, by myself. And I saw there's a new practice section here. And um, I thought I'd, for this video today, I'd just kind of show you guys what they've added, I guess. And now that I'm looking at it, there's a new section. When I looked at it yesterday, there was just bridging and MLG. Now there's fireball slash TNT jumping, which sounds pretty cool. So just, I'm just gonna go through it and you know show it real quick, and then we could probably play a game. And yeah, that'll be that'll be today's video. So yeah, this is this is the first one. So I think the the reason why they added this right is so there's this other server called BedWarsPractice.club, which got pretty popular. It has like a a bunch of like technique stuff. And also like like one v ones you can do. It's actually pretty neat, and I I've used it before actually. So I think the idea was like High Pixel was like, wait a moment, we could do this on our server, and then they did. So, but anyways, this is the uh, the bridging practice one. Basically, you could just go into settings, you can configure some stuff. So you could set the distance. I don't know what my render distance is for. That is very odd. You can change the elevation, so if you want to go up or up a lot, you can make a diagonal. So I think that's pretty neat. So you know, you just practice your bridging, try to get there as fast as possible. Um, you know, I mean, the, the other server I just mentioned has this too, but I guess it's nice that it's kind of like native on the Hypixel server. So I think, I think, you know, I think it's pretty neat. I don't know how much I'm going to use it, but whenever I kind of just want to mess around and bridge, I usually just go to, just go to a single player world. Just kind of bridge around. But I think it's still pretty neat. The other mode they have is, um, MLG, which is kind of similar. Um, you could either use a, a water bucket or, or ladders. And you just, you know, practice MLG and and you could of course change the uh you know some settings like you could make it really low down small you know i don't know it's pretty neat and then of course there's the ladder which i don't i don't know i mean ladder clutching this <laughs> i don't think that many people really use it in bedwars to be honest with you and it's also hard on here cuz Normally when you ladder clutch, it's usually because there's like a block up from a platform. But here you have to like clutch on the side. Which I guess is like the same thing, but it just doesn't feel natural. I forgot to mention this. You almost never water MLG in Bedwars. I mean, you can buy water, but I think I, I, I don't think I've ever in a Bedwars game water bucket MLG'd. And I think I have rarely seen anybody else. I don't think people really do it. So I don't know how useful this one is really, but I guess it's there. And then the last section is Fireball as far as TNT jumping. I have not seen this one yet. This one might be pretty neat actually. So it looks like... Huh. I guess that's kind of interesting. You just... Yeah, I mean, I don't know. You just do that. That was 12 blocks, alright. That was 11. 13, wow. Yeah, I don't really know how far you can get with this. I mean, you could do more than one. So you could go like that. Oh. Wait, how does that work then? Because it stops when you land on the gold. What? <laughs> Wait, how do you do this then? How do you use more than one? You have to like time it? No, I doubt it. That doesn't make sense then. What's the point of having more than one if it's... That's very odd. And they also have TNT jumping. Which, oh yeah, speaking of TNT, I got this new mod. Where when you place down the TNT, there's like a timer above it. Here, I'll just show you. Which tells you when the TNT is going to detonate. Which I think is really neat. It detonated way earlier than it said it was going to there though. Which is a little weird. Um, so you could like go into third person. 
Yeah, it, why does it explode early? That's weird. It explodes at like 1.4, I don't know why. That's very odd. Whatever, so yeah, you can kind of use the timer to time it. Like that. So that's kind of neat, I guess. I Maybe... Maybe if you give yourself wool? But you can't place it more than two blocks. So what's it, what, what, I don't get, I don't get what the point of this is. What? What is, I don't understand, what's the point of the wool then? Oh, maybe, um, hold on. Maybe so you like, go like that. Okay, I missed, but you go like that. Nope, it's not that either. <laughs> I don't know. Well, they added this today, so maybe they... <laughs> Just didn't think it through, or maybe it's a little broken. Yeah, I don't understand. What's the point of having more than one? I think like with TNT, you can like how do you do it? You go like that, and then like that, and you can like double TNT jump. I don't know how to do it really though. Um, I don't know. So I think you could like do that. I guess with the TNT. I don't know about the fireball, so what is the point of having more than one? You can't like throw them like quickly, right? It's not like you could I could just like look down and like double click. I don't think so at least. I don't know. Like in normal bed wars there's a cooldown between fireballs. Maybe not in this, but Yeah, I don't know. I still think that's a little weird placed on the defense. I don't I don't get what the point of the blocks though is. We're having more than one. I don't understand this at all. I understand it with the TNT, maybe, but like oh, that's pretty far. I don't know though. I think that's very weird. I don't know. Okay, well whatever. That's that. Let's play let's play a quick game. So we're on lighthouse, which means we're gonna have a pretty quick game hopefully. Which is good because I spent nine <laughs> Almost nine minutes in re in recording time, talking about that practice thing, which is more than I thought I would. So yeah, so I'll just keep uh keep this game as quick as possible, you know, and we'll get out of here. That's what my history teacher always says at the end of or like at like the beginning of class. He like goes through what we're gonna do for the class. And he's like, and then we'll get out of here. I think it's kind of funny. I don't... Okay, he dropped. I don't, I don't like it. Oh my god. Okay, well... Yeah. Okay, we're gonna pretend that never happened, actually. Um, oh, hey, hey guys, that, that, um... I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut that last game out. That, that bridge, uh, the, uh, practice thing was pretty cool, right? Oh, we should play a round of Bedwars now. Um, yeah. Alright, let's, let's do this. Looks like we're on, uh, Pernicious. Alright. You see how in my skin, when I'm wearing a helmet, it, like, cuts my eyes off? I don't like that very much. So I've been thinking of, like, <laughs> moving my face down in my skin. I mean, my skin is pretty... Pretty iconic, you know? It's like this turquoise color and then face. And that's it. I think it's kinda interesting. Um So it looks like green is rushing diamonds and then this dude is two, which means we should go this way. Which is not normally the way you go on this map, I don't think. I got him stuck in my block, that was pretty good. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get his bed, we'll see though. Well, I think we are. Oh, he killed me. That's alright. Alright, looks like he, he gapped up. He's going on top of his base. Why? What's the... No. No. Why? His name is Swag4. Or Swag IV. I don't know. I'm assuming it's Roman numerals. Like, why, why are you doing this? Like, stop. Ooh, he, he actually survived. It's probably really low, though, right? 
Um, he disconnected. That's really cool. I'm really glad I, um... Cool. Alright. Wade is coming over. That's interesting. I'm gonna... Make probably the bad decision of going back to my base screen and spamming pop-up towers. Interesting. Anyways, I'm gonna get sharp and a trap. Looks like white didn't finish bridging, so... He bridged most of the way for me, so... Don't have to go too far out, which is nice. Oh, I almost fell. Is he in the game? He is. Wait, where is he? He's there. He has a nice little iron sword. My sharp stone actually does more damage than that, so... Okay. Is he gonna drop? He did. Oh, somebody's at my base? No! I'm gonna grab that. Just kill him. My bed's probably gone, so... Yup, alright. So it's only a blue and gray left. Gray's there. Um, I'm gonna go to mid. I guess I'll just collect M's for now. I mean, I kind of want to win this game. I mean, I could just go rush gray and then rush blue, but I think the best decision is to just get rich. That applies for life too, you know? Just get rich. I mean, not hard. But it does make life easier, so no reason not to, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna head back... Blue is kind of at middle. Um, I don't know where he's going, to be honest. I'm going to go this way. I have a lot of emeralds. I'll be able to get prot 2 as well. This should be, this should be pretty good. We'll be pretty stacked. I'm going to get diamond armor, pearl, invis. I don't know. That might not be the best decision, but I think it's fine. Who do I think is more of a threat? I mean, it doesn't really matter, because it looks like I'm going to be having to take out both of them. I'm going to go for blue. I have Invis and a Pearl. Remember that. Gray's there. I don't want to use my Pearl. Although I definitely could. Alright. Screw it. I'm Pearling in. I'm going to fireball him off first. I don't think he fell off. Alright, and then I'm going in. Okay. Place TNT. Interesting. Cool, so we still have invis. I don't think Gray is very geared up compared to me, I guess. But I don't have a pearl anymore, which kind of sucks. Pearls are nice. Okay, I thought that bridge did not end there. I don't know why. So I kind of almost fell off. That would have sucked. I don't know where he is right now, though. So I think I can just kind of... <sighs> I'm fine. Don't worry about it. I think I can kind of just go in here. Cool stuff. Alright, I can get prot 3 here. Alright, he is spotted. He's running around mid by the looks of it. I'm gonna pot up now. Okay. Just gonna chase after him here. Goodbye. Yay! GG. Oh yeah, I got this, um grappling hook gadget so you know uh, if you guys have ever played um what's it called jesus christ what's it called skyblock on on the server there's a grappling hook in that but this one well yeah i don't know i don't know this, I, I can fly basically which i think is pretty cool um i don't know it's fun to play around with that's it. I don't know why I'm mentioning this. I... Um... Like and subscribe. Um, I am Bug27. Goodbye.